लोकसभा इलेक्शन निमिरे नागालैंड लगा कांग्रेस कैंडिडेट सुपुंग मरन जमीर पर मंडे ने पीजेपी सरकार लोगों ने भारी अटैक करी गिना कृषि के तो सरकार पर नागा पॉलिटिकल सॉल्यूशन नुकाई गिना से द्वितीय एग्रीमेंट दी गिना ताई कृषि के आरएसएस तो विषय सिस्टमैटिक पर काम करिया से और मोदी लगा सरकार इटा कुरिया तो विषय खतरनाक का से कृषि स्टेट निमिरे जमीर कृषि के नागा मनोकान पर 60 एमएलए खान के मैंडेट दी गिना से किंतु पीजेपी सरकार पर ताकान के विषय दिखता पोजीशन दे डाली गिना से और स्टेट सरकार के ओपोजिशन न था क्या बनाई गिना चीफ मिनिस्टर के विषय ओवरलोड कर गिना से तुम ने मिले मनोकान के इंसाफ पे दी बोले न पाए गिना से ताय कृषि के सरकार एक तरह ओपोजिशन न था किले कुन भी मनु लगा खान लगा मामला उठा बोले न था कि जाए जमीर कृषि के इतिहास टाइम से नागा मनु की भावना करे एतु दिखा बोले और वोटर्स कान सेक्युलरिज्म कानी वोट दी बोले लागिबो to the ERCC officials as well as the MBCC and we are also thankful that and we are grateful to all the people of the state that they are all agreeably waiting for the change in our state. Today the RSS the Muti government has played in a very systematic way and they have made a trap. They have made a trap for us and uh, the Muti government, the way they put our state in a position where it is very, very danger unless we came out and voice and project our right rights along with our precious vote our state is going to face the problem like the Assam Manipur and the elsewhere of the Northeast states we have even try to remove the secularism in, from the preamble of the Indian Constitution. And when there is opposition less, when they are commanded by the, the RSS PTV rules, there is no want to put forward to the government of India because they were controlled by the high command of the PGB. Now for that matter, the two agreements are also lingering. And not only that, other major political issues, and especially the secularism, the equality and justice are not delivering to the people by our leaders because it is not by our leaders but it is commanded by the high high command of the PGB government. Now when our most veteran and the capable leaders are combined under the, the command of the BGB we have only few citizens in our state like church organizations, the Hohos, civil societies, and the uh, innocent uh, voters. Till now, we are not under the command of the PGB. Now, do we allow all of us to put under the control of the BGB root? Do we also try to be the slave under the Modiro? The Nagaland British Congress feel that 
this is the high time that we have to show our sentiments. We have to fight for our secularism. We have to fight for the equality. We have to set the interests of the minority in the state. And for that matter, one has to be there in the parliament. One has to speak. One has to deliver on behalf of the citizens of the state. Now, Congress, as a candidate, we are fully dedicated to fight for the rights of our state. And for that matter, the Nalim Pradesh Congress Committee have a high hope and our voters are wiser than the leadership. So our voters will definitely come forward and they will cast in favor of the secularism where Congress is one to stand for the secularism. Today, the state is in a condition that we used to talk about the employment. We talk about the entrepreneurship. We talk about the schemes, but it is never delivered to our classroom people. It's a difficult situations where we can foresee is the Citizen Amendment Act, of course, they said as per the provisions, it will not be affected in our state. But once the house, once the door is opened, even today, we have enough, more than enough <clears throat> foreign uh, influx in our state. Now, once those citizens from the Bangladesh or Afghanistan, if they become the citizens of India, that we cannot stop the citizens of India to come in in our state. Definitely, a state like Nagaland, in the name of a citizen, we are going to face the problem. And secondly, the major thing is UCC, the Uniform Civil Court, which is only three agendas, one language, one country, one religion. That speaks the volume of how the, they are going to put the conditions in a state, a Christian state like us, are not. And that is the main agenda of the RSS BGB government. Now, if the BGB government comes, definitely they are going to impose. So far, they could achieve up to the implementation of the CA. And the next will be UCC. So we feel all those dangers line is on us so our citizens our precious voters is well aware of that and to avoid all this better avoid before anything happens and for that matter only the day to avoid is to cast a vote in favor of the civilians. We have, the people of the state has given a mandate to the 60 MLS elected members and they are the most qualified and the people has given the mandate best out of the best to our 60 MLS. But the BGB government has put them in a very difficult situation. 
we have overloaded the board of our Honorable Chief Minister, Shri Nilu Ryu, of making the opposition's less garment, which the Chief Minister also is now in a very difficult situation to move. Once he tried to move out, his boat also will be sink. And all the 60 elected members led by the 12 BGB MLS, they all are in the one oppositionless garment and they are not allowing to deliver the justice and for good of our people because in the party system high command is the highest authority and they all are binded by the RSS PGD government authority where all of them are facing the problems and when our leaders they themselves and they are even they are binding with the BGB rules then we cannot expect our public for any deliverance from them. Secondly, the BGB government has put on hold our another political solutions with the two agreements and in the name of the Naga political solutions, they try to play in such a way that there should be an oppositionless card. And a democracy, when there is no opposition, then where is the issues? When there is not opposition in the assembly, who will be the main persons to speak? in favor of our people and favor of Naga political solutions and in favor of the development of the state. Nangalin Nimide Congress Party Laga Lok Sabha election candidate A Supong Meran Jamepra Aji March 18th Ekta Press Conference Lugina RB Junaishiki All India Congress Committee or Party Members Kampra Nangalin Pradesh Congress Committee Laga President Gay nominate Kudishi. Tai Kushi AICC Pra State Te Justice, Peace or Equality Anibule Special Message DSA. Jamir Pra Aro Kushi Ki Committee Do State Laga Manu Kange Thanks DSA Aro State Te Change Anibule Bishi Monase. The Aro Kushi Ki Congress Party Khan March 2060 Tickets Bak Kurbulese. Nagalin De 31 State Star Campaigner Thagibule Kushi Aro Taikan Rahul Gandhi Malikarjun Karge Aro Priyanka Gandhi Gabi Request Kriginasi Kushi. wanted to share with our people that uh, the AICC, the All India Congress Committee and its leadership has decided to nominate the president of the Nalai British Congress Committee as a candidate for the coming Lok Sabha elections. And the special message along with the sending of a candidate, the AICC has clearly mentioned and directed us to convey and to deliver the justice, the peace and equality to the people of our state. As I said, uh, the voters of the state is wiser enough. Now, it is up to the voters whether they will give us the opportunity to fight for the common cause of our state. Unless they elect us, unless the voters give the confidence and send us to the parliament, even though if Congress willing to fight, 
when we are not inside the house, will be shouting from the outside, but it is nothing like shouting inside as a member of the parliament. So we have a great hope that last time in 2019, the people have come forward in favor of the Congress, but there is a the technical problems, which we all know, and the same thing, the hurdle is there, but the Nalim Pradesh Congress committee is strong enough, and we have a hope that even the 60 elected members, those who are now in the assembly, they also really feel for the Nagas, but they are not in a position and they are not allowing the free hands to move to project the problem of the state because they are under the high command of the BGB, which is ruled by the RSS. So the honorable members also will definitely understand. They may also like to send a, a person where everything they, they will represent on behalf of the 60 MLS in the House of the Parliament. So we have a great hope that the 60 members also will give a door open for the Congress candidates. We have, today we have decided to have our uh, general uh, conventions, that means uh, the, the distributions of the tickets, maybe uh, likely on 26. So once the ticket is awarded, that will be the kick-up day for the candidate. Can we expect any major uh, central leaders who will be coming to campaign for you, for the party? Yes, definitely. From our state, we have 31 the star conveners which we have uh, proposed. And uh, usually, the EICC will also send their star conveners. Since uh, Rahulji was here the last Yatra, we also requested him, as well as uh, our Honorable President, Kargiki, and special invitations we are making to Priyankaji.